Hi everyone, today we will see how to automate data cleaning in Power BI using Python. By learning this, you will reduce your data cleaning and preparation workload by off. Replace complicated macros with simple steps. Eliminate repetitive and manual data cleaning steps. These are the some of common data cleaning challenges. For this demo, I'll use football players data set. Let's import the data. Select the sheet. Click on transform data here. This will take you to the Power Query editor. Data is loaded. Go to transform. Select run python script. Here new window will open up where you can write code in python to clean the data. Here it says that data set holds the input data for the script. If we see the data here, row number 1 and 2 are completely same. 6, 7 are same. So to remove the duplicates, we will write simple statement. Just type data set equal to data set dot of duplicates. Click on OK. You can see the duplicate rows got deleted. Now we will see how to handle nulls in a data set. If you see the data here, there are nulls present for many rows. To change these nulls to any value, we will write a simple statement. Data set dot use replace function. If it is null, we'll make it as na. on ok here you can see all the nulls code changed to na in a simple step now we will see how to remove unnecessary columns present in the data set we will use draw function ask all the column names in a list which you want to remove I don't want face shoot Pass, dribble, and defense for my analysis. So I'll remove these columns. Click on OK. You can see all the mentioned columns got removed. Now we'll see how to rename multiple columns in a single shot. So We'll use rename function parameter columns as the dictionary with old name and new name as a key value pair. We'll rename long name to full name. will also rename nationality to country click on ok here you can see long name got changed to full name nationality got changed to country now we'll see how to split a column based on delimiter we'll split this contract column which has tilde delimiter if i split this column we'll get two additional new columns so we'll write data set of contract at date data set of contract end date as the original column name here 
it is contract use split method and pass the delimiter inside it click on ok you can see two additional columns got added with the mentioned names now we will see how to remove leading or trailing spaces from our values in a data set if you see here so many values as leading spaces so we will write a code to remove all these things right data set equal to data set dot we will use apply map method to apply a lambda function to each element in the data frame the lambda function checks if the element is a string and if so removes any leading or trailing spaces using strip method click ok if you see here all the spaces which had previous got removed now we will see how to filter rows based on a condition for now, we will filter rows whose age are above 30. We will write data set equal to data set of pass the column name here. Column name is age. Condition is greater than 30. Click on OK. Here you can see ages are there like 27, 29, 28 and all. Now all these rows should be gone. Now the rows are only present where age is greater than 30. You can see. There are n number of transformations you can do using Python. Next time when you work on a new project, you can simply use the Python template you created to clean and transform the data and save time. Thanks for watching.